So I'm Peter Dipola. Uh, I study chemical biology uh, in the College of Chemistry here at Berkeley. So right now I'm in the seed lab studying cholera and phage genetics and their co-evolution over time. Biology got a really bad rap for me in high school, but once I took it here and I really fell in love with it and it was like a completely new subject to me and so I switched to chemical biology and now I'm like really pushing the limits of how far you can go into biology with chemistry. What I love about biology is how interactive and complex it is. I was working in a lab my sophomore year and it was super cool. It was about antibiotic resistance, so um, we're having lots of issues with uh, these bacterial strains becoming super resistant to our drugs uh, and so we were working on a way to detect whether or not it was uh, resistant before actually administering the drug. I was really interested in that and I had this really cool idea about doing antibiotic resistance and using CRISPR-Cas which is like this new genetic engineering tool that was discovered here and so I thought what better um, than to ask the person who really characterized and discovered CRISPR, Jennifer Doudna, and so she was actually teaching Bio 1A at the time. And after class, I just went up to her and I was like, I'm finishing up my research in this lab and this is where I want to go. Do you have any ideas um, on labs that are doing this or people I should talk to? And she was like, oh, you should really look at this lab, uh, the seed lab. There, there seems to be some sort of virus with a CRISPR-Cas system that's targeting a bacteria. And so I was like, that's super cool. Um, and I went to talk to the um, professor and I was just like, do you have a position for me? And after an interview, um, she uh, matched me with one of her graduate students. And so that's where I am now. And I've been there for a year and I'll be going for a full two years once I graduate. It's cool to have a way to put yourself out there into the scientific community and be like, this is something I discovered. With the research I'm currently doing in the seed lab, I'm hoping to publish and then use that um, research as a way to get into graduate school. As long as you're here, there are so many resources for you that you can have hundreds of different paths. Like if I were to redo it, I could have a completely different path, but still come out in a successful way. And so that's what's really great about Berkeley is you really don't know what you're gonna do when you start, but as long as you want to do something, there are so many people who are willing to help you and passion is really your currency here in college.